Yeah, I'm with uh, Matt Lowe, our head coach in Manchester. Matt, uh, we are um, a few weeks into the uh, year-round programme here uh, in Manchester. Uh, how's it going at the moment? Um, it's been really good. Um, the, n the numbers that we've got this year in the squads has allowed us to have two squads, um, our development squad and senior squad, but all of the boys have uh, made a fantastic start um, to the season. Um, we've had plenty of fixtures, so it's been really busy. Um, training's been competitive, there's been competition for places. Um, so overall, as, as starts and seasons go, it couldn't have gone much better. Now you talk there about the, the numbers, we, we've got um, uh, great numbers on the programme all in all and that really does uh, help in uh, competition for places. Does that raise the standard of the football out there on the edge? Yeah, it certainly does. Um, the, the standard this year has been really impressive. Um, all of the coaching staff have been impressed um, with the IHM boys but also the Abbey College boys as well. Um, as I previous, previously mentioned, the competition for places is really good. So if, you, if you're not performing well in training or you're not working as hard as someone else, then there'll be someone um, fighting for your position on the pitch. So um, the numbers has helped the competition, definitely. Uh, now, we've had uh, a number of uh, fixtures and some great results uh, out there on the pitch. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about uh, some of those? Uh, yeah, so um, FC United a few weeks ago, um, quite convincing win for the um, IHM team, the senior team. Um, they end up winning the game 3-0 quite comfortably in the end. Um, our development team also had a game um, last week where they come away 4-2 winners after going 2-0 down, so showing great resilience and good fight to go back in the game. And in a fantastic game on Friday, again for the senior squad against Bolton Wanderers um, Education Football Programme. Um, it was a thrilling 3-3 free -free game on a Friday afternoon. Um, some, some great play from both teams and it was a really competitive game. Excellent. Now, um, uh, in the classroom, we've obviously got a lot that are doing A-levels um, with Abbey College and we've got some that are doing uh, B-Tech here. How's things going there in the classroom with the lads? Um, good. Um, they, they really get on well. The cohesion in the group is, is really good. Um, they're laughing and joking, but when it's time to do work, they understand that they've got to keep on top of their education. Because as we always say, the education is just as important as the, fo as the football. And from all the staff at Abbey College, we've been getting really positive feedback on um, the students' commitment to their education over there. Excellent. Um, now on uh, Monday, so just a few days away, they've got a showcase event. Um, and I know many will be preparing for that. Um, what type of opportunities does that um, give to, to the boys? Um, so what the idea of the event is that the boys showcase their own ability, their footballing ability, and the technical, the physical, the tactical understanding of the game, and sh show off their ability to the local scout, um, the local scouts, and also scouts from all around the northwest and the UK. Um, so it's a great opportunity um, to be recognised by professional clubs and a chance for them to break into the English game. Excellent, thank you. Well, good luck on the rest of the program. Thank you, cheers.